What's going on, y'all? This is Minion Training. My name is Dominion. Today, I have a lovely, easy video for you. We have a beginner back pain routine. Lots of people struggle with lower back pain in specific, but today we're gonna address that issue with three simple exercises. Let's get it started, right? So first, we're gonna be in a position, standing position, feet hip width apart. We're gonna get into a low squat, right? We get to a low squat. We're gonna hold this squat. I want you to notice how my feet are nice and flat. I don't wanna be on my toes, right? So watch my position here from this lateral position. I'm gonna be nice and straight. I'm gonna to try to keep my back nice and vertical. See how my hips sink in, right? A lot of people with lower back pain have extremely tight hips, right? We're sitting all day, we're compressing those hips. It makes it very, very difficult for our lumbar spine, right? Because we are putting all that pressure on those hips. So we're gonna alleviate some of that pressure all by getting into that low squat, right? If you have difficulties with this, I suggest grabbing a yoga ball, putting that yoga ball on the wall and getting into that squat to kind of help reinforce that vertical position in your spine. But if you can do this, right, without that yoga ball, if you, if you can do this by yourself, I encourage you to start with this, right? So we're gonna get started here into that low squat. We're gonna do this for about three sets, right? I just want you to focus on that breathing. Again, remember my feet are nice and flat. Keep your arms inside your knees. You can start to separate your knees to laterally extend those hips, right? Breathing, breathing, breathing here. Focus on that breathing. And let's take a little break. Let's take a little break. Awesome, awesome. You can walk around a little bit. I already start to feel my hips already getting warm, getting a little bit of sweat breaking down, right? I tell people <laughs> when we're stretching, when we're practicing mobility exercises, it's a workout, okay? I know we're not doing push-ups. I know we're not in the gym, you know, pumping that iron, but it's still a super, super effective workout on the body and the body is going to feel it, right? Let's get into this next set. I don't really want to specify any time. I just want to focus on, you know, everybody has a different comfortability place. Everybody has um, a different position. Um, there are different uh, places within your body as far as like your lower back pain. So I don't want to, to put a specific time. I just want you to get in this position and, you know, start to move around when you feel comfortable, when you really start to feel like, oh my God, this really hurts. You can come out of it. But I want you to focus on that breathing, a deep inhale, exhale, and let's come out of it. Let's come out of it. Nice, nice, nice. So I'm already starting to feel um, some some pressure a little bit. So a little bit of tension in my hips. That's not necessarily a bad thing, right? Especially if it's building up slowly because we're performing this exercise. If it was something acute, like very sudden, definitely I would want you to come out of it, take a little break, walk around, right? I don't know if you heard that crack. You're going to feel some cracks. That's normal, right? So our body can slowly and gradually get accustomed to this new um, um, dimension of tension that we're, we're stepping into, right? All right, last set here. Last set. Get into that. Squat. Breathe. Open up those hips. You should notice every time you breathe, especially when you exhale, your hips sink a little bit lower to the ground, right? That means they're opening up. They're deepening in that extension breathe and oh, that's it for me i'm, I'm feeling it right that's, again that's why i didn't want to put any specific time i just wanted you guys to get into the stretch what feels comfortable you can stay stay in it a little bit longer or you can come out of it right awesome now we're going to get to our second exercise is our cat cow right so we're going to be on our hands and knees make sure our palms are directly over our shoulders we don't want to be here we don't want to be here we're going to be directly over our shoulders, our knees, again, are hip width apart. And we want some good um, distance from our knees to our palms. We don't want to be too condensed and we don't want to be too wide, right? We want a nice, strong foundation. So as I expand my back, I'm going to expand my back, meaning I'm going to poke my back out to the sky. Simultaneously, I'm tucking my chin in between my collarbone and I'm moving my glutes inward, right? So... As, as I do all of these motions, I want to take a deep inhale. So I'm taking a deep inhale. On the exhale, I'm going to do the inverse motion. I'm going to collapse my spine. I'm going to poke my head and glutes to the sky, right? So we're creating like a vacuum-like motion with our spine. And basically, as we take that inhale and push our lungs out, 
right? We're pushing those back muscles. Those are called erecti spinae muscles. We're pushing them out, extending them, lengthening them. And then when we collapse, again, that's that vacuum-like motion, right? In our spine, right? Really getting rid of any adhesions, any knotness, any tightness in our back, right? And that's why that breathing is very important, right? So we're gonna, again, we're gonna go into three sets, no specific time. I'm just gonna do a few breaths, do a few reps. You can follow along with me. If you need more, go ahead and do more. If you know you do like two to three, and you're like, ah, I gotta chill. You know your body. You know what it needs, right? Let's get into it. Good. Deep inhale here. Exhale. Inhale. Yeah. Nice few more reps. See, I kind of put it top a little bit to really push that back out. Uh, one more. Uh, nice, nice. So take a little break. We're gonna do two more sets, all right? That feels really good. It feels really good. Um, we're already at like six minutes, all right? So this already, well, like time has gone by, but like, I already feel my back a little bit getting warm. I feel my posture um, getting a little bit better already. Um, so let's get into that second second set. Here we go, deep inhale. Exhale. <sighs> exhale, deep inhale here. Exhale, one more inhale. Hold it. Push that back and exhale. Nice, nice. Look at that. We got one more set to go and then one more exercises and we're finished. Super simple, right? If you are in the office or even if you work from home, right? All you need is a little bit of space in your body weight. Um, if you don't have a yoga mat, get a carpet, right? If you're a gangster, you can do this on a hardwood floor. If your joints are built like that, mine are not. So we're definitely on a yoga mat. So again, just reinforcing how simplistic this is, right? To get this healing. Not something super complicated, right? You don't need no miracle drug, no pill or shot. Those don't exist. And those lumbar shots, spinal shots, they last a few months and you gotta go back and then your body starts getting used to it. And this is something simple and very effective you can do on a daily basis to combat this pain and basically essentially live pain free. So that was three sets, right? I'm gonna change positions for you. The third and final exercise, a simple Cobra pose, right? This is beautiful for decompressing that lumbar spine, that lower back, right? And especially as we take our breathing, right? As I want us to be super intentional about our breathing and inhale, Exhale, every time we exhale, we should feel that lower back compress a little bit, right? Push those hips closer to the floor. This is also great for the hips, is extending the hips, lengthening the hips. So we're gonna get into it here. Push the hips down, make sure my toes are on the floor, not like here, I wanna be like here. Poke my head to the sky. If this is too challenging for you, right? You can be on your elbows and you still get some compression in that lower back, try to push but I encourage you to work your way up to being on your palms because you get a deeper extension in that lower back, all right? All right, let's go. Forehead to the sky. Very intentional about that breathing. Let's get one more. Nice, nice. Ooh, that feels good. That feels really good. Again, you're gonna get a nice decompression on that lower back. And as you exhale, you're gonna feel that back compressing even more. Um, and then after you come out of it, you should feel a lot of relief, like immediate relief on that lower back, right? This is something where like, if you're in the office and it's killing you, just get, get on the ground and get in the Cobra, get a couple of breaths in, do three sets. I guarantee you, you will feel better. It's, it's, it's so simple, it's crazy, right? All right, come on, let's get into that second set. Second set. Three. Nice. I feel the compression deepening and like my forehead is like trying to look behind me. One more breath. Awesome. 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 
We got one more set. Look, we're at 10 minutes. So this is going to be like an 11 minute, 12 minute thing. Look, if you don't got 12 minutes, if you can't carve out 12 minutes to get rid of your back pain forever, holistically, without paying nothing, I think you like the pain. I think you have romanticized the pain and you love it and you don't want to get rid of it. That's my honest opinion. All right. But I'm just me. Right. You don't have to take my word for it. <laughs> Let's get to this last set. Let's get to this last set. Oh, breathe. One more breath. One more breath. Now. Exhale. Awesome, awesome, awesome job. Look, that was 11 minutes. 11 minutes, three exercises, three sets each to permanently overcome your back pain for beginners. This is simple beginner exercises that you can do, right? If you're having back pain, if you're watching this video, once once again, I'm, I'm super appreciative. Like, I thank you for taking these 12 minutes, short amount of time, to click on my video to get this belief right go through the rest of my videos like share subscribe i'm going to be uh, putting out lots of value for y'all because i really do care about getting you guys a simple and effective um value to help your life right i appreciate you so much i'll see you in another video peace <laughs>